Hi DOIs, Joe from Alarm Grid, and today we're going to talk about how to program Honeywell 5800 sensors to your Simon XT panel. Now I have a Simon XT panel right here, and out of the box this thing will not be compatible with Honeywell 5800 sensors. It's only going to be compatible with Interlogix, GE, or Qualsys sensors, as this system only has a 319.5 frequency radio built in. The Honeywell 5800 sensors, on the other hand, they work on the 345 frequency, and as those are two different frequencies, they're just not going to communicate with the system. Uh, with that said, though, and before I talk about how to get the 5800 sensors programmed into your panel, one of the convenient things about the Simon XT with that frequency is that it can work with any Qualsys sensor, even sensors that are of the new S line encrypted model. Uh, they'll be able to be programmed into the system and they will work with the panel. They just won't use the, uh, the encrypted feature that's built into them. It's convenient to know though because that means that anything from the, the IQ2 or the Qualsys line that works with the 319.5 frequency, you're going to be able to use with this system. There's actually a translator that I'm going to talk about in a moment that we can use to get those 5800 sensors programmed to the panel from the Qualsys line. But before that, let's talk about translating wireless signals. So this thing has a 319.5 frequency radio inside of it, and the Honeywell 5800 sensors work on 345 frequency. We have to somehow change that 345 to a 319 so that it can program into the system. One device that we offer that you can use to do this is the Resolution 524 wireless to wireless translator. If you go on our website, you'll find it, and I do recommend checking out the installation manual for it. As you're going to see, there's two dials inside of the unit, and each dial is going to have multiple manufacturers that you can set it to around the dial. What this allows you to do is translate from one manufacturer to another. One dial, if we want to use it for the 5800 translation to our Simon XT, we're going to set one of the dials for the sensors to Honeywell, which is the 5800, then the other one we're going to set it to GE or Interlogix. What this is going to do is it's going to take the signals from the 5800 sensors, it's going to translate them, and then it's going to spit it out in the 319.5 frequency. This is going to let your Simon system see the, the sensors and program them in like any other wireless zone. It's a great device to use, and if you have a different model system installed that you're trying to do, or you're trying to enroll these 5800 sensors too, it's a great device and it may work for your need. I definitely recommend checking out the installation manual to see what it can do. Now, getting back to a point that I made previously, as the Simon can use devices from the Qualsys line, as it uses the same frequency, you can actually use the Qualsys 345 translator to get 5800 sensors programmed into your Simon XT system. This is real similar to the, the Resolution 524 translator, except that it only is going to translate 5800 uh, or 345 frequency signals into that 319.5 frequency. Installing that will allow you to do the same thing as the other device. It'll let you uh, translate all the 5800 sensors in the house to a frequency that the Simon XT can see, and then you'll be able to program them into the system like any other sensors. There may be multiple instances where you're going to want to do something like this. Let's say you have a Simon XT and you're installing it in a home that does have a bunch of 5800 sensors installed, and instead of buying all new sensors, you want to use the existing stuff. This is a super convenient way to do that changeover. Another instance may be if you see a sensor in the 5800 line that's perfect for an installation that you want to use, uh, but you do have a Simon panel installed, getting one of these translator units will allow you to interface that device with your system and use it for whatever security function you're looking for. If you do have any questions about this though, feel free to head over to our website, alarmgrid.com. You can also give us a call at 888-818-7728 or send us an email to support at alarmgrid.com. Did enjoy the video feel free to subscribe if you want to be updated when we post future videos hit the notification button below we hope you enjoyed the video and have a great day